All right, thank you for tuning in. This is a Handshake 101. It's 2021, to, yeah, the year, the New Year's, and we make a lot of videos. We have more extensive videos in our library here at Sky Include, trying to help you get included into the new Sky Internet. But this is meant to be an overview crash course one-off video you can each slide has so much to it so we can't get into it in the whole thing here also we encourage you to download the slides uh they'll be in pdf form in the notes so you could also share this in your communities as well to help share what's going on with with this so basically the handshake blockchain what what does this mean i know this sounds scary to some people even for me a little bit but essentially it means the decentralized internet and here is the handshake.org you can download the white paper read all about the documentation it was started by some really smart people that wanted to have a better way for the foundation of the internet at the tld level top level domain handshake so that people could own the tld not rent the tld and be able to have more power and uh, control of what's being built. It's also, I would call it the Bitcoin of domains. So Bitcoin is so popular, of course, the price right now in 2021 is going through the roof, but Bitcoin is basically money on the blockchain. This is domains on the blockchain. So you could say Handshake is Bitcoin of domains. Sounds pretty cool. Hopefully that's easier to understand. Essentially, these are blocks being mined on the Handshake blockchain. They're block numbers, and inside of those have transactions for buying and selling domains, auctions, DNS updates, and other info. First, you should understand what's the difference of a TLD and SLD. This is very critical in understanding Handshake domains. They are only TLDs that are being auctioned and bought and sold and updated. These are TLDs. Of course, you might know .com, .gov, .org, .edu. Handshake is not replacing these. They're trying their best not to overlap with these new ones being issued. Essentially, these are ones already in existence. But here's a little bit of an example here at SkyInclude. We have .skyInclude at the TLD on the blockchain. And we set up a SLD for this site, setup.skyInclude. So this the dot sky include is the TLD that is being bought and sold and updated on the handshake blockchain. So just like Bitcoin, you can mine HNS coin. HNS is the coin of handshake. You can look it up on various cryptocurrency exchanges such as CoinGecko. Uh, mining is an act of love right now. The uh, Profitability doesn't make too much sense from the numbers in early 2021 due to the price as well as the effort to get them. But you can still do it and uh, hopefully the price goes like Bitcoin has. Or you could just buy HNS off an exchange. There's a few different exchanges. Of course, Namebase is a very popular one in, in Handshake. There's a few others. We have videos about that. To just buy the coin to jump ahead. You might also have gotten some for free in the airdrop if you're a open source developer on GitHub and other contributors into the earlier internet. Once you have these coins, the auctions, they started in February 14, 2020, and they released more each week for the first year to not allow everybody, one person or a group of people to buy and own all of them. They're in auction process. We have a whole video about this. It's Vickery auction process. But this is the way it's kind of like the new internet is being born by people bidding on these. And it's a Vickery. So the second highest bidder uh, price is the one winner pays. Or you can just buy them from people that have already won them at auction. There's marketplaces at Namebase and there's lots of directories being built to show these different sites. So if you don't want to go through the pains of bidding and auctions and waiting for reveals and waiting for time, you just see one you want to buy, you can buy it if it's for sale. You can also gift these. That's been an effective way to help spread the word of handshake. You know, you can get a name for a friend or a company and, and give it to them. That's a pretty good act is a good holiday gift or birthday gift or, you know, good way to make a company like you. 
how do you view these? You know, this is one of the issues right now. There, It's not mainstream as I record this video. Hopefully it will be. It's not in Chrome. It's not in Firefox. There's various plugins like nextdns.io. There's various browsers dedicated for it, like Handy Browser. Um, and there's also different kinds of plugins on Chrome and Firefox to view these. The whole idea is hopefully more people enjoy this video and get involved in this and support the community and make it more widespread so the browser is actually integrated natively. So how do you build on Handshake? Again, Handshake is a TLD blockchain, top level domain. So these SLDs and other uh, updates are really done locally with uh, different services. But basically, from our studies in the last few months, it's essentially HTML, CSS, you know, just like a normal site. And you then upload it to either a traditional server and update the DNS or the new internet, which is a decentralized hosting. Skynet is a popular new one with Sia. And you can essentially put it onto a decentralized server and point to this decentralized domain on Handshake. It sounds a little scary or complicated, but basically it's just a new way of hosting on a, throughout computers all around the world. So hosting would be that way, or just traditionally Amazon S3 is supported, Vercel, and a few others. We have videos as well. There's also social networks coming out. Footnote is one with NMD or Nomad, nmd.co, so that people can build their own social networks and use Handshake as their identity, as their username to log into these platforms, which is pretty exciting, right? No more being nervous losing your identity on these large social platforms that just uh, decide you broke the TOS and to delete you. You own your identity. You own your content. Marketing tactics, you know, it's very early stage. We've done some videos. Essentially, you could build your own community on a top-level domain. You can get your company name or something about your community that they like to do. And not just sit on these domains, but actually try to build on these, issue these SLDs, you know, domains to people in your community, in your customer base, building out social networks. There's so many opportunities for this, and it, it should really create new things. It's not just for a domain. It's also going to be for receiving cryptocurrency. It could also be used for, you know, dApps, decentralized apps, so that these actually do things and take action rather than just hosting a server with a login and uh, and uh, content. Contributing to community, again, like I've said in this video, it's all about contributing to the community. It's um, it's very friendly, open. That's what we've really enjoyed it last few months. We've been involved here at Sky Include to contribute. There's W3C documentation being built now, and we need contributors. There's communities on Discord and other places, and we just really want to spread the word. So please share this. Again, I will let you download the PDF of these slides. Maybe you can show this in your local community, in your schools, your educational centers, you know, save some time making these slides. A little bit plug of what we do at Sky Include. You know, we've been really enjoying making these guides and videos. It's been on a big video frenzy lately, just trying to get as many different pieces of tutorials online. And we're also working on a page builder and a way to actually create on uh, your own computer and then directly upload into the decentralized web. It's in beta right now at skyinclude.com or setup.skyinclude. Thank you again for watching. And there, again, there's so many more videos we've made. We've been really working hard to try to make this as clear as possible because we believe this is really doing some amazing things for the internet and the future of society. Thanks again. Bye-bye.